Okay? Yeah. All right. Hi, this is Kevin Deal from Upscale Audio, and today I am here with Grover Neville. <laughs> okay, one more time. <laughs> Sorry. You were supposed to say hi. All right, that's okay. <laughs> no, it's all right. Hi, this is Kevin Dio from Upscale Audio, and today I am here introducing Grover Neville. Hey, everyone. I'm going to tell you about Grover in a second, but I want to tell you why I want to introduce him to you. You know, everybody here at Upscale Audio is special. I have a lot of great people that work here. I've got uh, Pete Soderberg that was like a big mucky muck at Martin Logan, worked there for like decades or something. I mean, a long time. I got Sean Smolin, who was a product trainer for Martin Logan. I got uh, Bill Rudolph that worked for Samico and helped them with designing phono cartridges, and he's in our analog department. I mean, Ash is an electrical engineer. I actually brought him here all the way from Canada and got him like all of his resident stuff and all of that stuff because the guy is so great. I put him in my shopping cart online and I brought him here from Canada. I mean, everybody at Upscale Audio, and I love it, and I love the team building that we're doing. And I was looking for somebody for the personal audio department for the headphones, and you know because I was advertising here for it for months and in magazines. And so uh, Grover, I'm gonna tell you about Grover in a second, but I gotta say something here. Stay on to the end because I've got a, a contest for you. I wanna see how smart you are and the winner is going to get a t-shirt. So before we uh, get to the t-shirt part, I want you to tell us about yourself a little bit here, Grover. Hi everyone, Grover, obviously now with Upscale Audio, but you may know me from Shit Audio, Odyssey, Headphones.com, uh, Inner Fidelity with Stereophile Group. I worked with Tile Hertzens back then, uh, and I've also hosted a number of headphone meets and other things like that. So I've been around headphones, I think, for about 13 or 14 years. So it's been a little while. Um, you've probably seen me in some other places. Um, and it's been an amazing journey going from being a community member when I was like 13. That was when I went for my first headphone meet. Um, and then eventually working in the industry, getting to see uh, both manufacturing um, as well as now the dealer side of things. So, uh, and then of course reviewing, which is you know uh, even another aspect of that. So I'm really excited to be here. Uh, as Kevin mentioned, we have a super awesome team of folks, um, and they're really passionate about the products. Like everybody here, more than any company I've worked with, is actually an audiophile. Like we have obviously that uh, those series of videos on people's systems, and like the people who work here are actually audiophiles and they actually really love it and they're excited to uh, build systems for you guys and to actually consult with you on systems that you're gonna like, not just trying to sell you stuff just to sell you stuff or any of that sort of thing. So I'm thrilled to be here and thrilled to work with them um, and to curate some awesome gear and help yeah. you guys get great sound. Yeah. So thank it you, was, Kevin. It was a long search to get you here, Grover. I mean, maybe I'm gonna show you guys a little clip from our Help Wanted ad. So, and Grover is also very tall. So it's really amazing. This is the first time ever that I've had to stand on a box to do a video. And I don't know that I really needed to stand on a box. I have a feeling that this is my sister Carrie screwing with me and got these guys to, to make that happen. Anyway, oh, let's talk about this t-shirt thing. I have a friend named Rick Johnson that passed away. He was my neighbor for like 20 years, passed away, audiophile, and I've got his widow called me and they were so kind to me. And so I got his old system, which is a stack of Marantz, and he's got some uh, uh, old JBL kits that he built. But the electronics of Marantz 20 tuner, and the, there's an amp back here. I want you to look at this Marantz preamp and tell me if you know what model it is, and not only that, where it was made. And the first person that answers that, that lives in the continental United States. You can't be somewhere off in, you know, Myanmar, though I love Myanmar. No. Continental, or actually just in the US, okay? Pick out a Tannoy shirt, a Prima Luna shirt, or an Upscale Audio shirt, and we're gonna get you the hookup. So let's see how smart you folks are out there. So look, I brought, uh, brought him on because he fits our vibe of not being a place that's high pressure and fitting into our no commission uh, atmosphere here. You know, I've always wanted to make sure that we do the right things for customers, which is why our company has continued to grow. We have a great loyalty here that we've developed over the 26 years of being in business at Upscale Audio. So I wanted to introduce Grover. He's gonna be doing videos along with Kat. Uh, make sure that you go to our website. Make sure that you come to our store because he's building a beautiful display uh, demo section 
to demo these things and the great headphone amps because we got the cool shit. We got Pathos, we got Felix, we got the Prima Luna stuff, yeah. amazing with the headphones and all the other things that we have going. Uh, and then uh, talk to one of our salespeople and make sure that you support your local dealer. Every town is better off with a record store and a hi-fi store, but if not, come to Upscale Audio. I want to thank Grover and I want to thank you. Remember this, at Upscale Audio, we're going to treat your system like it's ours. Thanks.